Well, did you know that Terry McAuliffe and uh, um, Hillary Clinton's brother are being sued by the Chinese? That's true. Uh, the um, uh, Terry McAuliffe is the governor of Virginia, the state that I live in now. No, I did not vote for him. Uh, his term as, go as governor is up. They only get one four-year term, and then they're done. So he's on his way out. And uh, let me tell you, even though in my area we lost jobs and our tolls went up and our roads are still bad, he thinks he's going to run for president. Okay. He's... Um, always been a big fundra fundraiser for the Clintons, whether it's Bill Clinton to Hillary Clinton. And what, um, what the Clintons and Terry McAuliffe actually wanted to do was they wanted to run a green energy business. Uh, they called it Green Tech. And Green Tech was to produce a, a green car, an electric car. And they went to get investors and Bill Clinton uh, in finding those investors, Bill Clinton, along with brother-in-law, uh, Hillary's brother, and with Terry McAuliffe, or Terry McAuliffe, they all go to China. And, of course, China wants to have a large profit in this business, and uh, they want to have, you know, four or five hundred jobs created in this business. But the other thing that they wanted was they wanted um, visas. And the visas that they wanted are EB2 program visas. So they wanted these visas. They invested $17 million. Okay, $17 million into this green energy sham. And if you look at the green tech company to, produ to produce the green car, um, the Chinese are not very happy. It did not turn a profit. It went from 350 jobs down to 10 jobs. And there were absolutely, totally, total number of cars produced were zero. There was not a single car produced. So the Chinese are suing Terry McAuliffe and Hillary Clinton's brother for fraud. They want their money back. And, um, you know, they'll, they'll hopefully they'll be able to get their money back. They, they just want their money back because they got their visas, which is what they really wanted was their visas. These EB2 visas. Uh, EB2 program visas. So they they got the visas. They just, I guess they can say we can try and get our $17 million back, but if not, that's the cost of doing business is $17 million to get. Uh, and and it, it, what I'm, the sources I'm, I'm reading doesn't actually state um, how many of those visas they got for $17 million in, for these Chinese investors. Um, but the, the Chinese are saying that Terry defrauded them and they want their money back. Um, now, there's another part. The state of Mississippi is where the plant was located. So, I mean, not even located in Virginia, the, the state where the guy is the governor. No, can't put any money into your own state. He goes to the state of Mississippi, which when you, I, you, when you find out what happens there, it makes you glad he didn't invest in his own state. Because the state of Mississippi, which is where the plant was located, um, you know, they're, su they're suing Terry because they chipped in money, they bought land, they leased land, they leased buildings, and they want their money back, and they want their property back that they bought for this company. And so those are a couple of these 
scandals that uh, Terry McAuliffe has that is leaving him as he leaves the uh, the governorship here in Virginia. And no, I did not vote for him. I'm embarrassed of anybody who did vote for him. And so that's, you know, uh, showing you that the man who wants to be president, perhaps in 2020, uh, that just goes to show that he is like the Clintons. He is a pay for play kind of man. So there you go. I'm out in three, two, one.